Hi, and welcome to this week's edition of The Buzz. Todd Jaden and uh, Kelly Polk, fresh back from uh, Associate Appreciation Days uh, that we experienced out in the field this week. And, and Kelly, I was able to, uh, to make it to Birmingham, Alabama, where I saw our uh, folks over at the Home Depot in McCall, Alabama, then moved on to uh, our Savannah Warehouse location, Got to tour and visit uh, with associates in all five of those buildings mm -hmm. in Savannah, and then uh, was at our Target Midway dedicated account on Thursday. Just had a uh, a great week in the field. So where where were you? Oh, I had a, Todd, I had a great time. First of all, you know, I left here uh, and spent some time in the Indianapolis area. Spent uh, you know the morning at our Aurora Parts uh, facility and talked with a couple drivers there. It was a, just a great visit. Went over to the NDOC and spent time over there. From there, visited our, our Family Dollar account up in Ashley, Indiana. A new startup, a lot of activity there, but uh, just some, I think, some great people. And and uh, spent the rest of my time in the Chicagoland area, the Gary O.C., and then went, uh, went and visited uh, our friend Laura Till at, um, at Goodyear in DeKalb, Illinois. And so, uh, you know, Todd, what a great experience. Uh, I've always said I love the smell of diesel. I love getting out of Green Bay, and I love spending time in the field. And what a great experience! So it was good to see you all. I hope you had a great um, week. You had appreciation days, and uh, boy, everywhere that I went, it was a festive environment. Yeah, it, uh, it really was, and you know, certainly uh, one of the things that I like to do when I get out in the field, in addition to talking with our associates, especially in the uh, the dedicated operations is to uh, get some feedback directly from the customer and so I had an opportunity to speak with uh, folks from the Home Depot and from Target both and they're extremely pleased with uh, with what we're doing in those locations. The Home Depot is a relatively new account for us, started up in December and so they were very complimentary of the way that uh, that we've started up there. Now Target Midway, uh, we've been doing that business since 2007 Brian Myers leads that. Mm -hmm. um, we have uh, 32 drivers down there, and 15 of them are million mile plus Holy cow. safe drivers. And, and I got to talk to a number of them yesterday. And you talk about a group of people that's proud of what they do. The other thing that was just outstanding to hear from them is they've been operating the business since 2007. They have never had a lost time injury due to work wow. in six years. So that's great, uh, great work. Thank you for that. Um, keep that uh, streak going, a very proud group of, of drivers. And then I will tell you, uh, the Savannah Warehouse, I hadn't been to that location um, in a number of years, and those warehouses are full, people are busy, um, and really some exciting things going on yeah. down in that, uh, that Savannah area. One of the things that wasn't as exciting was the weather. Uh, Tropical Storm Andrea kind of chased me out of, uh, of Savannah, so got out on the, uh, the front end of that. They were expected to have uh, 6 to 10 inches of rain today, so I hope uh, oh, that's yeah. not the case. Yeah, I had great weather. We, it was just beautiful here in the upper Midwest. and Got a little rain yesterday, but, uh, but a great event. And we're going to have some video uh, from you know, some of the festivities. Um, Sherry Murphy will be working to get that and make that a part of the part of the buzz. But one of the things that that um, I, it just kind of strikes me, Todd, is Lori Ludi, our chief financial officer, um, was competing for a water in a water uh, melon eating contest, and and uh, gosh, I can't wait to see that footage because that would have been something special to yeah, see. Yeah, I saw a couple of still pictures of that. So uh, Lori, you looked right at home eating that watermelon. Oh my God! Um, so it uh, that that's the kind of things that were going on. Yeah. Across the network, I've had an opportunity to talk to a couple of people as I've returned to the office this morning, and they've all shared uh, similar stories. Yeah. So it sounds like a really good event. So congratulations to our John Deere tractor winners. You know They were announced yesterday, and uh, again, hopefully everyone had a great experience. We had a lot of fun, certainly, and look forward to this every year. And so watch for some additional footage, and um, hey, we'll, uh, we'll talk to you next week. And let me close by saying thank you to you, Kelly, for the role you played in pulling this thing together. Uh, certainly Tammy Grunert, who's not with us. We probably should have put her between us to, uh, to Believe say me, I tried. Thank, to, thank you to her as well because uh, it was done very well and, and your team did that. So yeah. it's uh, much appreciated. Yeah, thank, it was, you. Uh, thank you and, uh, and a lot of people contributed. 
And uh, Sherry's out sick today, so uh, sitting behind the camera is uh, Shannon Smith. Shannon, thanks for uh, playing Snurgly today. Yeah. And we'll see you next week. Have a, have a great week. All right. Take care. Drive safe.